Oh my god, bro. Like no one could have been in this back seat, dude. Like we hustle daily. What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy. Big Play Ray coming to y'all with another auction video, man. We at Copart. We're about to do this walk around here. But if you haven't already, before we start, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. If you haven't already, you just now tuning in and you're new to the channel, consider subscribing to the Hustle Nation. You know what I mean? We hustlers over here. Now, if you ain't no hustler, you ain't even got to subscribe. Just stay over there where you at. It's all good. Just, just stay over there. But if you a hustler, make sure you subscribe. You should definitely be subscribed to the channel. But make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. Link in the description below. WeHustleDaily.co if y'all haven't already. And make sure if you want to learn how to make money, if you want to learn how to check out cars, um, you know, you don't want no lemon at the auction, you know, because you don't know what you're doing trying to buy cars. Even if you are mechanically inclined, you still, this auction game can be tricky. You know what I mean? I don't want you on the side of the road. I don't want you having your kid on the side of the road because you just bought her a car, a little college car. She was supposed to be going to college next month, wasn't she? Yeah, but you done messed around. You came to the auction and bought a lemon. So make sure you go to whdacademy.com. I done helped a lot of people, uh, you know, learn the business, learn how to make money in the whole nine. So make sure y'all check out the website and let's get right into it. What's up, Hustle Nation? This video has been sponsored to you by whdacademy.com, the online course that's going to teach you everything you need to know about the auction game, all my tips on how to properly inspect cars, and most importantly, how to make money. As you can see, I've been doing this for a while. And as you can also see, I have plenty of testimonials on how I've helped others gain success in this business. So if you're interested in learning, be sure to click the link in the description below. All right, we got a Range Rover Velar. Y'all let me know if y'all think these are girl trucks or y'all think a dude can pass for driving one of these. Is this the same one that's been here? I'm not sure, it probably is. Y'all know the door knobs go in and out. But y'all let me know, like if you're a dude, would you drive one of these? I think they, I don't know. I think they could, it could pass, but okay, we got a spare. It looks like the damage is probably gonna be somewhere up under the up under the undercarriage because this rim is bent. We got this hangling and dangling. The rim looks straight though. I don't know. I think this might be the same one. Let me see. This is open. Pushing the button. I'm pushing the button. Let's see what we got. Nice, 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 nice. Got that, 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 that cream. Got that cream interior. What the heck is this for? Must be to move the seats up. I'm not sure. Oh, you got the roof too. Twenty thousand miles on this one. Oops. R dynamic. Seats is all right. How you open this damn thing's hard to open right there. Jeez, Louise. But they don't. They didn't do too much to the. They just left it plain and simple. They just give you a screen up there and just leave all that blank. I'm not sure if that stuff is gonna light up. I don't think it got power to it. Nope. They got the sticker still on the seats. What y'all think about the Range Rover Velar R Dynamic? Y'all let me know if y'all think they are girl trucks, SUVs rather, or y'all think a dude can, you know, dude can, you know, he can ride and he can slide in this too. Y'all let me know in the comments below. All right, check this one out. This is a nice one. Uh, Mercedes with the wheels. I'm digging the wheels. The wheels are definitely clean, like a cream color. Big face on these Mercedes, man. You gotta love the big face. I'm digging the coupe, y'all. Y'all know the Mercedes S500 coupe, S550 coupe. That joint's super nice. These are growing on me, though. They just, I just like the coupe better, though. But look at this right here. This will be a nice, easy fix. In the future, we're definitely gonna have to rebuild a car, man, because like something like this would be like super easy. Like, I don't know too much about rebuilding stuff, but oh, okay, it's gotten getting a little worse. I thought, you know, it was just right there, but we got this wheel caved in a little bit. I like these wheels too, they're Shanties. Okay, on the 20, what we got? 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. Let's see if we can find another one. But as you can see, the door, then two up the door. 
along the side. Let's see, we can see what size rims are these, 22s. You can see the 22s. And they look like they offset. Definitely got the silver tint. What y'all think about the silver tint? I like usually black tint, but the silver doesn't look bad on here. Big freaking door right here. Got a little, they go to parts in here. Double roof, nice mirror. I believe that's what this is. Yep. Two mirrors, sun visors on the roof, on the, I don't know what that is. What is this? Like a light, maybe. Maybe that thing's a light. Inside, probably could be back to like bring oh, get back brought to life. These seats look like they just massage you, they probably do massage you. Little console, trash, got the little phone thing. I think this goes up and comes down. I think that's what it looks like. It looks like it folds up. I'm not sure. Oh. Wow, I never knew that. I never knew that. If y'all knew that, y'all let me know. I never knew that. Did that. But you gotta love the double screen. This is a 2014, by the way. Probably, definitely. Let me see. How you? There you go. Definitely, though. This boy is nice. I'm digging the creamish color on here, too. Ooh, let's see. V8, I don't think it's turbo or nothing, just regular V8. So, gotta love the big face. I know these are the parking sensors. I just uh, learned that not too, too long ago. But I do like the Mercedes that actually, this actually is in here and it lights up. I like that. But what y'all think about the uh, S550? Let me know in the comments below. All right, y'all, I just got to show y'all this because this is crazy. So you see the Corolla, right? This is a Corolla. Got the front. Looks like they probably hit something in the front, right? Looks like they probably hit something in the front. And then you go around to the back. Oh, my God, bro. Like, no one could have been in this back seat, dude. Like, bro. Bro. This man look at the trunk that's crazy backup camera bro dude you oh my you gotta hope nobody was in the front dude like oh my god look at this dog that's crazy right there oh my god Look at this, bro. Look at the seat. Like, couldn't nobody have been back here, bro? That would have been super. Look. Damn. Oh, man. That would have been super bad, dog. The driver would have been all right. Man, make sure y'all drive safe. Make sure y'all don't text and drive. Make sure y'all just be safe, man. Because that right there is ridiculous. And look. Like, what the heck? This, that's the bottom of the trunk. And that's the top of the, like, man. That is ridiculous. Dang. Man. Make sure y'all be safe out there. Here to a um, Durango RT. Might as well check this out since it's just in the middle like this. The Durangos look nice, man. Lexani's on this one. Had the Ashanti's on the bins. The Lexani's on here. What size are these? 22s. 22s. Do got some damage, though. Poor Durango. Looks like they tried to cover the, the um, damage, but probably just had got these, didn't they? Want some good meat on them tires radiator and everything is off 23,000 miles on it this is the newer one because it has the uh these lights 
these long lights. What's that for? This is four. Seats are nice. This is the nice one. I told y'all like my mom's had one one of these before she had got the Camry. I'm gonna have to surprise mom's one of these one day. She liked this this truck. She had the old Durango before this one, so she's just a Durango lady, you know. And they got the you know you know how Dodge. What the hell is that? And you know how Dodge look. You know they got the uh, they got the aggressive face. You know, they got the aggressive face. Some roof, everything in this one. So this one is nice. Let's see what year this one is. Uh oh, was they drinking? Oh, I don't know what that is. I'm not gonna touch it though. Nah. So yeah, nice wheels though. You can tell they had just got it. Let me see, 2019. So 2019. So this is a pretty newer, new truck right here. Just. Crashed it and they had it looking good too with the Lexanis. But what y'all think about the Durango? Let me know in the comments below. All right, what the heck is this? I have to get this on camera because I do not know what it is. I do not see no badges or nothing. Some type of Subaru. What the heck is this? I have not seen one of these before, I don't think ever. You don't got the sticker on the nothing, so I don't know what it is. 164 on the miles. Oh, we got some stuff back here. There's the bumper. It's got leather interior. I mean, cloth interior. I'm tripping. It's got cloth interior. <laughs> oh, man. Some type of Subaru something. Look at it, though. Some roof in it? What the heck is this? If y'all know what this car is, let me know in the comments. It doesn't have a... Uh, doesn't have a thing on there but look how the car like look how it wraps around like on the steering wheel type but i still don't know what this thing is oh that's what i was supposed to do i was supposed to pop the hood where the heck is the hood there it is what is this guys i don't even like have a clue on what it is subaru boxer that's not what it's called, that's the motor, right? Definitely looks like a Subaru motor for sure. I don't know why the battery's leaning over there on that side. But if y'all know what this little Subaru is, y'all let me know, cause I have no idea what this thing is. Let me give y'all another look real quick. So you see the front? And then it actually looks like it got some type of charging mechanism right here or something. What the heck is that? The, the defog, def, defog or something? So I say, man, let me give y'all another look. Y'all let me know what type of Subaru this is because I have not seen one of these before. All right, check it out. We got another Tesla um, truck here. This is the second Tesla truck I've seen here. Another one was a red one. This one is just all messed up though. Oh, I like that. It has a little portion there and a little portion on the other side. This is not gonna let me in, are you? Dang. Ooh, look at the Tesla light. That, was, that light costs it's probably like five hundred dollar headlight right there. Jeez Louise, what's this? They suspension? It's air ride or something? I think it's air ride. Y'all let me know in the comments. But y'all see the damage? Damn, what happened right there? This one is all tore up though, but you can see I like that how the roofs, and then the, it got it starts right here and then it goes down. Like I think that's pretty cool. If you ask me, it's just like a glass house in this thing with the suede and stuff. Looks alright. Looks alright. But that don't look alright, right? right? <laughs> got the Bentley. I showed y'all this Bentley. I'll show y'all again. Bentley been here for a minute. All right, so I'll show y'all again. Got some damage right there. Damage, 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 damage. Damage, damage, damage. It's the flying spur right here. Damage. 
Bentley all tore up from the floor. Damn, then they kissing the Mercedes and the Bentley kissing and stuff. Got the W12 in this thing. Yeah, I definitely showed y'all this one. Now this is my type of interior with the diamond stitching. Okay, and I can hide that. I can open that. I can do all type of stuff. Put a little something right there and all type of stuff, right? Blue carpet. I got a little screen right here, okay. Right, okay. So yeah, I definitely showed y'all this one. It's dirty though, but got the blue. That blue was that blue nice. Blue hidden, that blue hidden, that blue hidden. And this is a, a 14, so 2014 Bentley. All right though, let's keep it moving. But all right, Hustle Nation, it's gonna be a wrap for today's video, man. Again, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe if y'all haven't already joined the Hustle Nation. If you a true hustler, you need to be subscribed. There's no way you should be subscribed. Your notification bell, sh not post should be on all. Your bell should be on all and everything. You should get every notification, you feel me? But again, y'all wanna learn how to check out cars for WHD Academy? I don't want y'all on the side of the road now. I'm trying to tell you, I'm trying to save y'all life. Shout out to Cold Park, I'm trying to save y'all life and I'm trying to save y'all money, you feel me? <laughs> shout out to Cold Park, man. Appreciate Cold Park. Shout out to the whole Hustle Nation. Appreciate y'all. It's your boy Ray. Big Play Ray. I'm gone. Peace.